I'd like to ask you what your vision for the church might be. You know, your Martin Luther King moment. What's your dream um, of how the church can be in the future? I think, well, it's a tough one. That is tough. I think for me, my visions for the church, um, you know, and I, and I should start by saying that I think my vision for the church is of a church which is not even yet existing. I, I think the church is still to be born. It's, it's not, it's, it doesn't almost exist um, as it ought to be. So for me, that that is the first thing to say. I'm I'm longing for a day when the church is actually born um, and actually exists. But my vision for that church is is of a church which um, draws closer to one another, a church in which there is a deeper intimacy, because I think that when we draw closer to each other, we draw closer to God. Um, a church in which we can look one another in the eye. Um, and in doing that, we can see the face of God in those who are different to us um, and in those who, who might have different convictions. Um, I, I think I, I have a longing for a church which is weaker in many ways and which relies totally upon God um, and which only cares about the fact and only trusts in the truth that Christ has died, Christ has risen, and Christ will come again. 